Hi there, YouTube. It's Joni from Smiling Shrinkin', and I'm coming to you guys today with my week 14 update. Um, I kind of skipped over my three month. Um, I actually took pictures that day, but it was so strange because even though I lost over 15 pounds, you really couldn't see any difference. I mean, unless you put them really close side by side. So what I decided I would do is that every other month I'll do skin pictures just to kind of see the transition and um, how things are looking. So for today, the week 14 update, um, I had my DS surgery on August the 4th down at Mexicali at Mexicali Bariatrics with Dr. Escara. My high weight was 378. My day of surgery weight was 325.5. Last week, I came to you guys at 270.8, and this week I come to you at 269.8. That is a one pound loss for the week, um, a 55.7 pound loss since surgery 14 weeks ago and a total loss of 108.2 which is fantastic now I know some people would go one pound but um, it's always been my pattern that I lose in chunks that kind of go down like a stair I just came off of two rather nice weeks in a row so I kind of figured it plus I'm feeling a bit like a girl this week so you know so anyways I think that part is fantastic um, I have just a couple of little things I want to share with you guys this week and to keep it short and sweet one I want to thank the Carlson clan for my awesome new drinking beverage so cold mm. it's actually pretty funny it holds 30 ounces of cold beverage and the ice stays cold all day but I don't know if you can see this, but this little straw is actually metal and it gets just as cold as the beverages. So one of um, one of my little daycare guys, um, he always wants a drink of my juice. And I tell him, I don't give drinks away. I get hugs and kisses. So I always get one big hug, a kiss, a kiss on this cheek and a kiss on this cheek. And then I'll share my drink. So he went to take a drink and it gave him brain freeze. He went, ah! <laughs> Sorry, that's kind of evil. I shouldn't laugh. I'm so sorry. <laughs> but um, I just wanted to thank you again for my giveaway present because that was what I won. That's what I did with it. So thank you so much. I'm doing so good with my water drinking. Um, there's a couple of new people that I'm new to. I don't know if you guys are already following or not, but there were two new DSers this week. Um, I know sometimes people might go, well, I'm a sleever. I don't know if I should follow someone who's a DS. But you know what, whether you had bypass or even the lap band, um, you know, the sips or regular DS, the thing is we all have so much more in common than we have differences. We just need to support each other, build each other up. But um, so today, the two I wanted to tell you about was Skinny Mini Paige. She is just amazing. She's just this young thing, just totally cute. And uh, she actually had the sleeve gastrectomy a couple of years ago. She lost over 200 pounds. Isn't that just, oh, yeah. And so um, she did that as the first stage and just this last week had uh, the completion of the DS. So hopefully she'll get down even lower. And man, she is cute. So, and really quite delightful to watch. The other person that I wanted to tell you guys about, her name is Heather Feathering. And she is just as sweet as can be. And that poor girl got sick right before she was supposed to have surgery. So they had to put it back for another couple of weeks. So yay to Heather, you finally got your DS. That was yesterday. So I sure hope you're doing well. If you get a few free minutes while you're healing up, just shoot a little, a little message. Let us know you're doing well. And I sure hope everything went really smoothly because um, I'm just real happy for you. And the thing that was so neat about her surgery was that she lost 20 pounds waiting. Ha ha ha. Take that, DS waiter. <laughs> so um, I'm very thrilled for those guys, as well as, you know, of course, everyone else. When I get my updates on my phone, I go in and watch them. And what I do before I start watching my shows for the night, because I love my shows, <laughs> is that I'll watch my any updates that are on my uh, YouTube first. I watch those in the evening before the good shows, before the evening shows start. So that way I get my fill of inspiration and um, encouragement so that's been pretty awesome so uh, 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 oh I have one other little non-scale victory and some of y'all might not be big enough to understand how this <laughs> is so cool but um, one of our little skinny friends um, learned this she was pregnant and she had dropped something on the c on the car floor and so um, she was like I don't know how I'm gonna reach that until we get to where we're going we said hold on and our friend hit the brakes which made 
you know, it makes you lunge forward. So she was able to bend down and pick up what she had dropped. She turned and looked at us. That is the coolest thing. We said, yeah, that's the big girl trick, right? So my NS my NSB comes in was this week when we were driving something fell down by my thing and I just bent down and grabbed it and put it up and handed it to my friend. She goes, oh, look at you, skinny mini, grabbing stuff off the ground without even having to hit the brakes. So I thought that was kind of cool. Thought you guys might like that story. Um, other than that, uh, I said last week I was going to try to get to the water aerobics. I did not do that this week with the election and everything going on. It was a little crazy. Oh, and I'm not going to lie, Monday Night Football. It was the Seahawks. I had to miss that. Sorry. But um, hopefully this next week I will start getting in there and uh, getting a little bit of exercise like that. Other than that, it's been a wonderful week. Um, I'm going to wrap this up short and hope that you all have a great week. Talk to you soon. Bye.